Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have the Motorola Zoom. As you can see, if you go to About Tablet, we are running Android version 3.2. This update came in, uh, well, for me, at the very end of the weekend, my Monday here in Taipei. Uh, I do have the option to go to the Petit Petit launcher, uh, so that's something that we are, I am using on my Zoom. Uh, one of the features that we'll see here uh, with 3.2 is we have the option for smartphone apps to go full screen. Uh, you can see that this, this looks fantastic on a smartphone, but it looks absolutely terrible um, here on the Zoom. So we have the option to stretch to fill or zoom. Um, now, whenever I switch around, I actually get an error message. So this is what it would like on the typical smartphone screen. And if we go back, It'll stretch out here. This is in this small zoom button here down in the menu bar. Now if we head back to the tablet itself, one of the other great features that we've got is SD card support. Now I've actually lost um, the cover here for this. I have no idea where it went. Uh, one day I just didn't have a cover for the top here. Um, sucks, but whatever. Uh, the SD card still can go in. No problem. So all we have to do is we'll go into settings, we'll go into storage. Okay, wait for this to calculate. All right, so it's actually already mounted automatically. Um, the first few times that I had to put in the SD card, um, I had to mount it. Now, I restarted my device twice. Uh, which seems to have gotten rid of a lot of the bugs with the SD card, but the second time I put in the SD card, the unit actually shut down. So I recommend restarting your tablet a couple times, and it'll probably work out for you there. So now you can see in the gallery the SD card actually um, pulls up the photos. Apparently I don't have very many photos. I, sh I should have quite a few. I've got a folder in there called Manta. Hmm, so I don't actually see um, the folder in here, but what I do see in the album is this is on the external. So this is a time lapse of, uh, let's try the native video player. So you can see this playing off the SD card. It's a bit slow. We're getting some pixelation. This is actually, a, yeah, we're getting some pixelation off of here. It seems to have evened out a little bit now. So this is actually a 1080p video. Um, this was done by our cameraman James on a quick trip over to Hong Kong. Um, this is the Hong Kong Harbor. So all the pixelation issues and the freezing seem to have stopped. Let me try that again. Let's see if it plays perfectly the second time around. No. So it takes a minute um, for your video player to start reading properly off the SD card. So if you're looking to play 1080 video, 1080p video off the SD card, a little bit iffy. Let's go back to the home screen and let's see if I can find the, 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 the Manta Ray folder that I had on that card. So now here's, the, here's, my, here's my file uh, browser and I actually don't seem to see it. That's actually really interesting. Now this SD card for sure has a folder called Manta Ray, and I was going to show you um, some photos of scuba diving in Bali, but apparently that is not going to happen. So yeah, that's all that's in pictures. That's a little interesting actually. Let's try here, file types photos. Now let's see if the photos just show up without the folder. This is actually just showing me all of the page downloads from um, my Zinio application um, for reading magazines. <laughs> so that's actually terrible. When you pull up file search, it just pulls up all of these. Uh, yeah, I wish you could fix that. All right. So that's been a quick look at a few things that you can do um, here with Android 3.2. Not a huge update. Um, but SD card support is absolutely massive. So if you are 
if you are seeing, say, full screen apps, that you want to make them even more full screen, things just get bigger. So it's kind of an interesting feature. Um, how much I love it, I'm not really sure. Everything that I've seen scale doesn't scale perfectly, but the SD card support is a big one. Alright, so this has been Nicole Scott for Netbook News, taking a look at Android 3.2 on my Motorola Zoom.